Alrighty, hello everybody. Subject here, and welcome to our survival evolved. Alrighty, so. As we can see, we are on the island map. What I want to be doing um, much, but I just know that I'm going to be playing this map. I'm not sure if we're going to be going through the DLCs or anything. But as of right now, we're just going to be chilling. So, we are doing essentially like legitimate stats. So it's 1 times XP, 10 times taming, and 3 times harvesting. And then all the stats are normal. See, are a little teeny bit boosted. the thing that we don't die as much. They still massacred, but who knows. Level is this? 25? Ooh, 120. Um... Hmm. Alright, maybe I'll sit here and try taming that guy real quick. I'm gonna kill his brother and then tame him. What do you need for spirits? Fiber, of course. Alrighty, let's make a bit of spears. Yeah, so I'm going to kill the 25 and maybe try getting a quick little tame on 120. Because if I could get the 120 right off the bat, that's going to be pretty nice. That's going to be a lot of really easy transportation on my end right there. And honestly, I don't think I've ever actually tamed, like, a dolphin, like, first thing. In fact, I've never really killed one like this before. There we go. Do they eat just raw meat? I thought they ate fish meat. Ah, uh, thinking about it, I should have maybe just killed a fish. I didn't really think that one through, did I? Alright, um, where was the 120? Shoot, I think he's running. Hey, bud, do you want normal meat? Nah, I'm gonna go get a bit of fish. Wait for them to calm down. I think there's one... There should be some fish up here. Let's go find a fish. And then... Is that a baryonyx? That is a baryonyx. I don't really want to deal with them. Is there any fish just anywhere near here? Besides up there? Ah, oh, Pega. hate those things. If I tame one, or sorry, if they grab me and then decide that they want to be mine, they will be getting some sort of conventional weapon in the head whether it be an axe or a spear or eventually a bullet they will be executed on site pigos i hate them i cannot stand those things ooh a manta ray interesting <laughs> uh 
Um, I don't really want to mess with it because I think it actually may just straight up kill me. See a fish up there that I might go for right there. If I could get a dolphin just right off the bat, because I think this saddle is like below level 15. That could be really good because then I could save a lot of resources on building a raft. Because usually what I like to do is build a raft and then like start going around. But if I could get... There's a lot of manta rays. If I could just... Ooh, that guy's actually only level 5. But if, yeah, if I could get a fish that goes very fast, that'd be more preferable. Really? Come here, fish. You're gonna be mine. Level 110, jeez. I got some fish meat. I am drowning. Alright, I need to find the level 120. Alright. Looks like he's kind of just hanging out there, so I'm gonna uh, sit here, get a bit of stamina. Alright, and now we're gonna hop in. Hey, buddy. What you doing? Oh, okay, you're just... Don't kill yourself, please. 30%, so that'll be four bites. That's fine. Four bites is definitely okay. The heck? The heck was that? Was that it? Do they make that noise? I didn't even know that. Yeah, I don't. I'm not used to actually taming underwater creatures. <laughs> So for reference, I played this game for a longer time than I would like to admit. And in realism, I've actually never beaten the game 100% legit. Which is kind of going to be the purpose of this, is I want to actually beat the game. Ow. Oh, I'm dead. Yep. But yeah, the goal is to actually beat the game. That's the plan. So, I will most likely be just going through the arcs and just kind of trying to do them all. But, who knows? Right now, I need to maybe make a bunch of spears and just kind of slaughter those mantas. Just don't swim up to that Baryonyx, because he will mercilessly kill both of us, essentially. Stop running away from me. I'm trying to give you food. You'll live a good life until I have to sacrifice you for my own good intent. Then it won't be that good of a life. But until then, it's going to be a great life, if you think about it. Right, I'm just going to sit on this rock and wait for it to hunger down. And while it's doing that, I'm going to do my engrams. Okay, so let's get a campfire. Let's get that. Let's get that. Didn't want to get the single panel flag. Really did not want to actually get that. Okay, well, I guess let's get a campfire. We'll put some wood. Start cooking up a bit of this meat. Let me spread out some of this. Just so it, we get some spoiled meat and we can make some narcotics right off the bat. Is that Pega? <sighs> da, da, da. Can the campfire go underwater? I'm assuming not. All right, we got some meat cooking up. Okay, I guess for some reason all my meat in my hot bar is gone. Oh, the pig I must have stolen it. Great. Well, it's fine. I should have enough. What what level these things are called? Itchy somethings. Oops. Um, 
itch. Nope. Um, IT? No. What the heck are you guys called? Is it IC? ICH. ICH. Level 13. Okay. So we're pretty close. We're, we are five, four, six levels off. Yeah, I actually tamed one. Alright, buddy. You're going to wait right here for me. Right next to my little campfire. I'm going to go level up. I'm going to make a few things. And then we're going to go on a trip. To a place. So, for base location. Let's look on the map here. I want to be near, essentially, all the important things. Like metal, oil, silica pearls. Because... Mostly, I would like to be able to have access to those things. I want to make a gigantic base. I want to have the resources to sustain it. So, I'm thinking somewhere near the winter biome, maybe. That could be a good uh, thought process, the winter biome. Okay. You're going to live for a little bit, bud. But just know it isn't going to be for long. Come here, boy. I want my spears. But yeah. So maybe we live in um, the winter biome. So that's going to add a bit of strain. Because I'll have to get the... Oh, I got black pearl. I'll have to get, obviously, the fur coat. Otherwise, I will slowly but surely die of uh, freezing to death. <laughs> um... Besides that, I don't really see any downfalls with the plan so far. Um, a few thoughts is as to where. Maybe we build... So if you look at the top left at 30 lat 10 long, there's like a gigantic ice, like, um, ice capsule almost there. That is a very good base location. But I prefer to not be away from the mainland. So, I don't know. We'll just have to check things out up there. Just, like, see what we could do. Because we need dino storage. That's very important. And we just... We need a lot of things for the space location to actually work. So, we're probably going to move up somewhere along the lines of 50 lat. And then maybe 15 long. So, in that little, like, uh... I, I want to say peninsula, but I don't think that's the right term for it. And we'll probably just live there for quite a while until we have the needs and necessities to be able to actually keep moving. So, that's my little spiel done. But, that's a turtle. Turtles move fast in water, it's actually kind of crazy. I'm just thinking if there's any actual explorer notes nearby. I don't think there is. I don't think there's any in South Spawn 1. Honestly. I know there's some on the West Coast, which is how we're going to be going. So I may go kind of in that direction. Kind of do things there. What level are you? Easy. If I could actually hit my shit. And hippity hoppity. Oh, you're alive? Just die. Please. You're so bloody. There you go. Thank you for my spheres back. Thanks for your contribution of hide and keratin. It will certainly help me, good sir. Plus XP. That's kind of the main reason I slaughtered you. Okay, um, let's get a bulla. That's pretty important. When we get the bow, we'll be able to just kind of kill a bunch of things. 
but so let's go see if there's some innocent dodos that we can take care of and by take care of i mean you know kill them Ooh, mosses uh mosses mosso chops bud what do you want giant bee honey that's a shame Monster chops are very good uh, tames, actually. They have decent, actually, carrying weight, uh, and plus they can—they're um, pretty fast, and they have decent stam. They're just kind of good, like harvesters at the beginning, if that makes sense. So, if I didn't have the uh, dolphin, I would actually probably try getting that or a parasaur. Oh, we got Dilo coming up. I'm trying to get to maybe about 300 weight for right now. I may increase it to about 400 later and then kind of put the rest into some other things, but... But yeah. So right now I'm just kind of trying to level up to get the saddle. Bit of an XP grind. If I unlock wooden foundations, I'll be able to get um up there pretty fast, but that's not Monster Chops, level 10, nope. You're gonna die, bud. Alrighty, there we go, and I am out of stamina, alright, two more levels, I am going to get the bow and the wooden foundation, alright, now we can actually level up here, I'm actually going to make a mortar and pestle with this stone, I'll reduce like 50 pounds to two. As shown by my weight right now. Alright, let's grab 50 fiber. Ta-da. Hit some trees. Ta-da. And saddle. I'm going to just throw this wood away. I'm going to throw some berries away that I don't really need. I'm going to keep the oil. Oil will be nice. Although we will be in the winter biome, so it won't be that necessary, but still. Alright, let's get going. Let's roll out. Sorry also if this feels like a speed run. I've attempted to do this series essentially like three times already. <laughs> and most of the time I kind of just sat there and was like... What the heck? Was that Pega? Oh, those are copies. Okay. I had actually no clue what the heck that was. Oh, hey, bud. That was a Pega. That's a shame. Oh, you stole my wooden foundations. How nice. I thought that was a Pega. Should have trusted my gut instincts. Where's my campfire? How'd you get down here? What happened, bud? Ah, eh, whatever. Right, let me take this. Let me take this. There we go. Now right, I want to get rid of this wood. Let me put another point in weight. Alright, bud. Oh, that's what happened. Uh oh. Nice. Got one. I should actually maybe help it, shouldn't I?
All right, bud. Listen, we're going to stand and fight here. What a guy. Kill it, please. Let's go. Teamwork. You are almost dead. I think I hit you with a spear, didn't I? Yeah, okay. Also, your weight is very garbage. Alright, we're gonna put you in there with the necessities, essentially. We need a bed. We need this. We need this. We need this. I just realized I could actually just get on you. Okay, wow, you are fast. Oh my goodness. Look at you. Here, I'm actually going to remove that spear out of your eye. There we go. Wee! Jesus, boy's fast. Look at him go. Let's go to the bottom of the ocean. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, that was a mistake. <laughs> that was a mistake. Swim. Swim for your life. Jellyfish. Okay. Let's get some air real quick. Alrighty. I'm going to leave you here, bud. I'm going to go grab this supply drop, and then I'm also going to go grab this, uh... He is dead. Did you just kill a freaking Alpha Megalodon on your own? What the heck? What a guy. I thought that was an Alpha Megalodon. I'm like, oh my god, that Alpha Megalodon must have been like level 1. I have no faith in his ability to kill one of those things. Am I even actually... I am, alright. Yeah, that's... That, I, there we go. That's actually kind of convenient. There we go, we got clothes. Hello, turtle. I'm gonna grab this, don't mind me. And then... I am going to... Do big brain play right here and whistle for him to follow me. So come here, bud. And then he should run up the beach with me. Alright, never mind. I still have a ways to go anyway, so I may as well just bring him up here to where I need him. I'm gonna go grab the, um, tech, uh, thing, majig. Uh, fun fact, this is exactly where my first base was. I'll show you in a second. Oh, these make a lot suck. So, this was my first actual ever base, right here. So I had a gigantic dino pen into the water as well because I wanted to be all-inclusive. So I had like Sarkos because I tamed one of them. And I'm like, oh, they like water. So I'll make like a little water pen for them thing. And <laughs> and I always set them all on wandering because I was like, well, it's kind of rude to like not let them like wander on their free will, right? And they would glitch through the weird, like, really badly placed walls that I would have. And they would always escape, and it was just horrendous. <laughs> and up here was our first actual, like, legitimate base. We had, like, a house up here. So, I need to figure out how to zoom out first off. the heck do I zoom out? It's left trigger, right? Ah, there we go. Okay, it's behind me. 
So yeah, this is a very nice tech uh, thing. Fish, why are you like this? We're gonna put this fish out of its misery. There we go. Alrighty. Let's get going then. Are you sprinting? Oh, you're just fat. Gotcha. You guys wanna be in a cult? Eh, sucks. Oh, ah, drowning. I'm actually going to tame these itchies. I mean, like, the more the merrier. <laughs> I may as well. I'll have an army to protect me. Alright, we're almost here, I think. So, as I was hypothesizing, is just a decent word for it. I'm going to be living essentially up here. I think I'm going to go into the, like, on the right side of this. Because I don't want my guys to be on the outside into the open sea. For pretty obvious reasons. I'm actually going to drag them all up here. Into here. So, alright guys, let's all get going. Our level 7 got killed. They are hurting a lot, actually. I can no longer move because I am encumbered. This has become a literal fight for my life. And I'm proud to say that I just won it. The amount of meat that this boy has... The amount of manta rays, uh... Okay, we're going to just go into the bay. Yeah, that seems like a great idea, actually. We are going to actively run away from all these issues. How close are you to death? You must be pretty close. You're just fine. Look at you. You're not even bloody. What were you doing that entire time? What a jerk. <laughs> Alright, we're going to leave you guys here. Alright. Wow, you really got a lot of meat for no reason. Look at that. Right, I'm actually going to take the important things off of you. So, I don't need Megalodon teeth. Because, honestly, that's pretty common resource. I'm going to take the arrows. And I'm going to put the meat onto you. You're going to be my meat carrying. Although, I do want my metal back. So, if I could have that, that'd be great. I'm going to increase your health a little bit. Alright, this is a good little place to make our starting before we move into the winter area so actually we are out of time for this episode so in the next one we'll be making our base building up getting some actual tames besides dolphins and yeah we're gonna be going to the winter biome oh also for reference i am playing this on xbox uh and yeah yeah, anyways, so thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.